Hey there peeps, welcome back. Rampage Reviews number 94. Okay, um, continuing with the list of uh, Golden Globe nominated slash winner films, I bring to you my review of the 2014 film by Tim Burton, very different for him, Big Eyes. Let's give you a look. So big eyes of Amy Adams and Christoph Waltz, who is absolutely extraordinary in almost everything he does. Love him, hate him. You always have some feeling towards him in every film Christoph Waltz does. You know him from Django Unchained, Water for Elephants, um, uh, what Horrible Bosses 2, which I just recently reviewed. Um, big Eyes is the true story of um, of the lady who painted the big eyes pictures uh, in the 50s and 60s and got the credit claimed by her uh, weird Nazi husband. Um, now, what distracted me from this movie is that it's it wasn't a challenge for Amy Adams to act this film. She's a brilliant actress and this was just kind of normal for her acting range. Um, it didn't really demand anything except being sad all the time and giving her blonde hair is some of the worst things I have ever seen ever. Um, this movie is very artsy fartsy and um, the, the paintings she does are brilliant. I love the big eyes pictures. I think they're awesome and stuff. But I just don't like stories um, that uh, are about weak women um, because women are very strong in my opinion they're probably stronger than men uh, in some respects in most respects actually um, so I just don't like to see films about women getting degraded but I'm pretty sure that's what this film was out to do that um, you know she she you know, rose above and stuff like that. Um, but it's it, it was just kind of weird. I can understand it um, from a point, you know, a woman um, being degraded by a man that's a lot bigger, a lot stronger, threatens her, a domestic abuse sort of situation, really, really deceiving type of thing. But this guy didn't really have, her husband in the movie didn't really have a presence about it. It was like he could be pushed over at any second, I felt. Um, so she must be super, super weak not to stand up to him type of thing and to deal with it for so long as well and not know anything about her husband I just I just found this movie very unbelievable and um, even though it's based on a true story or whatever um, I just found it very unbelievable and very fucking boring and just just very sadistic I, I didn't like it that much um, it's it shot really beautifully and stuff and it's all about the art I suppose um, Christoph Waltz steals the show with it the the daughter and it's fucking annoying as shit um, I, I just I didn't think anything of it, therefore giving it a 4 out of 10. Um, that's why it didn't get nominated for any Academy Awards, really, and didn't win any, but it got nominated for the Golden Globes, the, the lower echelon of, um, of the awards ceremonies. So 4 out of 10 from me, 7 out of 10 from 15,000 numpties in the world, and a 6 out of 10 from critics, which I'm sure will go down soon. Big Eyes, 2014 with Amy Adams. Don't bother. Stick to her other movies um, that she actually won awards for. All right, peeps. Catch you on the flip side. Bye-bye.